One of the questions I get a lot is how to automate multiple strategies on the same symbol in TradeStation. And so I wanted to set that up for you this morning. Order filled. I have a sh couple of strategies here on the one minute chart and two minute chart. This is a strategy that simply alternates long and short trades on every bar. And so you can see on the one minute bar, it's buying it. If it's long, it goes short on the next bar. If it's short, it goes long on the next bar. Same thing on the two minute bar. So they're different intervals. So they're different strategies since they're different time frames. And they are, um, it's a, this is a multiple strategy setup for the same symbol. We're using the at ES H17. We've turned this on in SIM mode because this is not a profitable strategy. It's just a strategy to demonstrate how to set this up. And I wanted a strategy that fired trades frequently. And I have strategies, but so far today, only one of my strategies has taken a trade. And so in order to make this video, it might take a three day long video in order to see a scenario where multiple symbols are uh, multiple strategies are trading on the same symbol. And I didn't want to do that. I want to make this a short video. Field hopefully less than 10 minutes that I can explain this to you. And so for demonstration purposes, I'm using a, a very basic strategy. I'll show you the code in a minute, but I want to explain to you what's going on. Since this is alternating alternating trades, you see that the um, long we're long here on this chart, one minute chart, and we're short on this chart, two minute chart. And so this strategy is going to alternate to the, in about 30 seconds, the one minute chart is going to fire off a short signal. It's going to reverse from long to short. It's going to go from net long one to net short one. And since the two minute chart is already um, short, we will be net short too. So we're flat right now because the two minute chart is short and the one minute chart is long. And so we're flat. So this is how you would implement this in your if you're using the same account, you can Order put these in the same account um, and implement strategies because so right now we're short too because both strategies are short. And in another minute, this is the um, they're both going to flip to long because every two minutes this one alternates and every one minute this one alternates. And so um, this strategy is going to flip from short to long in a minute, and so is the two minute version because it will be at the end of its two minute. And so you'll be We'll be going long four contracts to offset the short two contracts, and then we'll be net long two. So you kind of, in this sort of strategy, you, you go between short two to long two to flat, and then so it alternates back and forth, short, long, flat, short, long, flat. Um, and so you'll, you'll be able to see how this works when you implement this in the same account. Again, this is a SIM account strategy. I don't want to trade this account live. And we're going to see this flip here in a few seconds. Order filled. So they both went long. So you see the position right here. You can see at the top of the matrix, um, the position is 2. And so this, the close p and is, is 350. We're cumulative minus 375. Don't trade this strategy for real. Um, here is the code. Really simple code. If it's long, we go short on the next bar. If it's short, we go long on the next bar. And we add this line right here because we need a need something to fire the initial trade. When you first insert this strategy into the chart, it's neither long nor short. So you have to add this, add this to either one of these signals so it has a first initial trade. And so another 15 seconds. The one-minute chart is going to flip out to the short side. So it's going to short two. And the two minute will still be long, and so that'll keep that'll make us flat. And so watch this signal as Order it goes off field. here. So it sold two to go short, and so the one minute chart is short, and the two minute chart is long, and so we're flat. You see in the order matrix we are flat. And so what is the next trade going to be? The next trade is going to be net long two because in one minute the two minute bar and will be will end. And so, actually, no, it won't. It won't end. Actually, it's going to flip to short. So this is going to flip to short, and this is going to flip to long, and so we'll be flat. I hope this isn't too confusing. I know I'm doing a lot of talking. There's a lot to look at when trades are firing every minute. I thought about doing this on 15-second intervals, but I think that would be a little too fast to explain what was going on. Uh, but you could if you wanted to um, test this on your end just to see how it works. And so you could do this with... 
um, multiple strategies. One minute, two minute, you could add a three minute chart, a four minute chart, a five minute chart, and do this alternating, alternating order trade. filled. And so oh, we're flat again. So this one flips to um, long, and this one flips to short. And so now we're we're flat. We went from flat to flat because um, they flipped positions. And now the next trade it should be net short because. We're in this short trade on the two minute chart for two minutes, while after one minute, this will flip to short by selling two, then we'll be net short again. And so we'll have the cycle, the cycle going um, from, you know, short to long to short to long, or flat actually, short, long, flat, short, long, flat, um, depending on the order that we're at, order where you are. So. Again, this uh, the code is, is right here. If you want to type this in and test it on your end, it's two lines of code. Put it your account in SIM mode and test it on as many charts as you want. At first, when you first turn Order them on, filled. Uh, if you turn them on at different times because they fire so quickly, you'll have to make sure you're in sync by maybe placing a manual trade in the order matrix if you're not in sync. And so... Now we're net short, and so you see the net short position, net short two. The one minute is short, the two minute is short, and then um, at the end of one, in one minute from now, the short will, the one minute chart will flip from short to long, and so we'll be flat. And you'll see that as it updates. So after this trade, I'm going to show you how to set this up in automation. So you won't get an error. I'm going to turn automation off and then I'm going to turn it back on. So you can see how, to, how you might be out of sync initially in a strategy that fires trades quickly. Every minute if you're turning on the one minute and then it fires a trade before Order two minutes filled. turned on. So our strategies don't fire this quickly. So we're net long to. So let's format strategy. Let's turn automation off. Say OK. And then you get this question here. Let's close the position. Order filled. So it sold one. Let's turn automation off on this one. Uncheck that. And you get this question again. Say close Order position. filled. So we're flat. Automation is off. Now let's turn automation back on. Format strategy, click this. I turn confirmation off because I don't want to sit here and confirm every trade. Properties for all, and this must be checked, the third box down. Allow multiple automated strategies on multiple charts using the same features forex symbol in the same account. So when you turn automation on, you're going to get this. Do not exit this position because we don't have that position. We'll just take the next trade. So we'll just wait and let it take the next trade. So now let's turn automation on here. Automation on. What happens if you don't have... So you click OK and it asks you the same question. It already took a trade in the two minute. I had to pause the video there for a second. Um, so exit this position. So it is, uh, the two minute is short one. I should have said, okay, I said exit. Exit this position. I should have said do not exit this position. Since I said exit this position, it will sell two on the next sig signal. If I said do not exit this position, it would only take the new position and sell one. So I want to get in sync with this. Order filled. And this matches the position. Order filled. So that was flat, and the in the in the market position was flat. Now it's net short because both of them fired a short signal. Hope that makes sense. I know it's fast. Test it on your end. Play with it in sim mode, and you will know how to set up multiple symbol automation. And I didn't I didn't go over the error. I want to go over the error again real quick. I turn this off. And then I turn it back on. And I turn automation on.
if I don't check this box right here, it'll tell me, no, I don't want to disable automation. If I click OK, this is the error you will get. You have one or more charts already automating your strategy using the same symbol in the same account. It is possible this strategy may trade in the opposite direction. Order filled. It tells you to allow the reversing exit and entry orders to be placed simultaneously. Okay. So that's what we do. Properties for all. Automation. Right there. And then when you select OK, you're back in automation mode. So we got to get long again. Order fill. Order fill. Sync. So that concludes the video. It's about 10 minutes.